this is a major milestone getting under the river. It's always good to see when it comes through and it does match what the survey shows. The pipeline crosses under Trinity River near Trinidad, Texas. We have been at what we call the Trinity Tunnel or the Section 17 Tunnel for a couple of years now. So the challenges that we faced on this East Drive is we had about seven faults that we were going to encounter. When we got to the river bank, we had a formation on the ground material that was going to be um, highly weathered material. The geology going under the river is very challenging with respect to uh, the soil type. This was not rock face mining. This was, was soft soil mining. Very challenging, managing the groundwater, managing the soils. We had to do some, uh, some stabilization grouting to help the soil stand up as they mine forward to be able to put the liners in, things like that. So that's why this was such a, a challenging aspect and a major milestone in this project. They're using GPS laser control to drive the machine. We ended up utilizing a PPS system, which is a guidance system for tunnel boring machines. It can then tell you where the machine is going, what type of attitude it has, if there's any roll, and if there's any misalignment, you can take care of it at that point as a live time instead of having to do it with the laser and having to take measurements and kind of guess what's going on at the face. We're able to do it with the live feed, essentially like you would with the GPS system in a vehicle. They had six inch clearance on either side. They were dead center. Their control was excellent. So it was a pleasure for all of us, uh, especially the guys that have been driving the tunnel on the east. We had a tough time, but it was uh, well worth it seeing that come out. So it was just a, a great moment for all of us. It was a good experience. With that portion of the tunnel complete, the liner's in place. The, the next step will be to install the pipe, weld the pipe, grout the annular space around the OD of the pipe, the carrier pipe, and the ID of the tunnel liners. And at that point, that part of the tunnel will be complete.